Hey guys, Silence here, here. Welcome back to another gacha episode of Utah Cross with me. So this time around, it's all about Milane because finally we have gotten the second gacha of the event. And let's take a look at the episode plate that belongs to Milane um, that provides custom points for her well fancy coral swimsuit. That's what the name of the swimsuit is. And yeah, let's take a look to see if Milane's plate is identical, almost, to Basara's. Okay, so oh, we're on the last page, so immediately we see that it's exactly the same as Basara's in terms of not having a special note attached to the episode plate, which is fine. Um, we just have to see whether the stats are similar to Basara's and of course the skills. Basara's episode plate is an episode plate meant to be used in the center position for high score purposes. So maybe Milane's will be a support episode plate um, to, to, to be used with Basara's, I guess, exactly like how um, Fire Bomber is. Basically, Basara is the lead and Milane is the backup singer or, you know, uh, whatever terms you want to call her by. Uh, Musically, <laughs> so here we go. Three thousand six hundred and twelve. If I'm not wrong, I think it's actually higher than Basara's. Let's take a look. All right. Yeah, the total score is actually higher than Basara's. Wow. All right. So for once, Milene has uh, well, sort of a bigger highlight than Basara, I suppose. <laughs> okay, so both episode plates are focusing on Soul, which is exactly what Remember 16 requires. It requires episode plate of the blue element or uh, Soul element, the Inochi, whichever you want to call it by. Then of course, um, it requires the stat Soul uh, to be its main point scoring factor. Alright, so... Um, okay, so it doesn't have an S rank center skill, so immediately we can tell Milane's plate is meant to be used as a life skill support, uh, which is fine. You can never have enough life skill support episode plates, but it's always hard to get a good center skill episode plate. So alright, let's move on. Active skill. Now for 12 seconds, your combos do not break. So, um... The active skill is pretty useful when it comes to the second event of the month where you have missions and you maybe you're required to not break combos or maybe you have to attain certain amount of combos in order to clear the missions, that kind of stuff. If not, well, the active skill could be used to help you attain those rewards from brand new, stalls, brand new songs or Maybe like the daily event songs where they reward you based on your combo and you know, you, you're trying to clear maybe the extreme difficulties or maybe a difficulty you are not able to handle so easily. Um, such active skills might actually give you that um, boost in combo uh, because you're trying so hard to get those rewards, that kind of stuff. So yeah, uh, life skills, score and damage. So. Immediately, yeah, it has a fantastic life skill meant for high score purposes. Um, but sadly to say, just like Basara's, their total score is only of uh, 3,600 uh, value. Considering that it has that plus 25 luck, um, I will still put both episode plates under tier 2. Uh, nothing of a 2.5. Um, they are still pretty decent episode plates. So once again, if you guys don't have episode plates of this element uh, with this kind of standard, I think adding these to your collections are uh, still pretty much uh, well what you want to do. Uh, but of course, if you have something better than this, I would say stay away from the episode plate or rather the gacha. But you know, because Milane's swimsuit is only uh, obtainable through this gacha pool or rather from the episode plates that appear, especially for this gacha. Uh, maybe in the future, you might get those free episode plates from playing lives uh, here and there, and they contain costume points for the mains. 
but you won't know when you'll be able to unlock her costume unless you specifically pull this gacha or maybe um, future returning gachas uh, that contains episode plates for Milane's costume itself. So yeah, um, so with all this said, I am going to do a single template pool because I only have just enough for one single template pool um, for Milane's gacha. Alright, so let's do this guys. Um, hopefully not pulling Basara's gacha might give us that boost in luck um, that we really need. Oh, there is some loading there, so we can hope for something nice to appear. Here we go. One. Oh, nothing else? Okay. <laughs> well, at least give me an episode plate that contains points to the swimsuit. So I will be contented with that. So that I can maybe obtain her swimsuit through episode ops in the future. Here we go, the first red box. So no evolution to it. Oh. Is this for her costume? Let's find out later on. Here we go, here we go. Lots of repeated old plates. I don't know whether I have this Cheryl plate though. Uh -huh. Alright, lots of max. And... Ah! So we do get two new episode plates, if I'm not wrong. Um, this should give me costume points for Milane's costume. Oh, look, apparently the Basara's one is an old episode plate. Oh. I really like the evolved image though. Yeah, it looks pretty nice. I wonder who belongs to... Oh, uh, Milane's birthday costume. Okay, that's pretty nice. Okay, so we should get a notification to say we got Milane's costume points. No? Uh oh, this does not belong belong to Milane. Oh no, oh no, <laughs> I don't have enough stones for now. Maybe I could do a single pool. I don't know. I really, really want to at least gain uh, a bit of costume points for Milane's costume. So let's do a single pool. Uh, I'm risking it all on a single pool. That's horrendous. Come on. So there wasn't loading at all, so that's kind of worrying. Uh oh. Oh! Oh, we got a red box though. <laughs> Makina, I don't know. Your, your smiling face makes me feel confused. I don't know whether to be happy seeing you smile or sad because I did not get costume points for Milane's swimsuit. Oh, this is such a dilemma. Ah, oh, god, guys. Once again, luck is not on my side. So, <laughs> thank you guys so much for watching. Hopefully, all the information I shared to you is useful as always. Let me know by hitting the like button to this video. Of course, share out the video and all that good stuff. Uh, subscribe to the channel if you're not subscribed just yet. And I'll see you guys in the next Utamekra's Gacha video. Until then, bye!